Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is about my favorite hair products that I use on my wash and goes. And I actually have one product in here, what I what I use on my twist outs that doesn't work on my wash and goes, but I'll get to that in a minute. So I'm going to insert a picture like right here of how my natural curls normally look, like a straight wash and go. This here is a twist out. If you're interested on seeing what I love to put in my hair. I'm gonna be showing you six products and I'm gonna show you them in the order which I use them. So, in case you guys wanna know, cause to me it does matter and I'll explain that too in one second. So first and foremost, I wash my hair with shampoo once a month and I usually pick, I mean like first week of the month I try to get around to um, washing my hair with actual shampoo. But other than that I just use conditioner. So this is the first product that I use. So this is the first product I use and I came across this by accident. I was looking for, um, I usually go with Tresemme ever since I've been natural. It works perfect for my hair. Um... I came across this keratin, I don't know if you call it keratin, keratin, whatever, and it has five benefits, um, one system, anti-frizz, perfectly detangles, silky shine, soft feel, tames flyaways, and it's with marula oil, and let me tell you, like, this is not a gimmick, it legit makes my hair look so beautiful and so soft, and I love it, I actually use it on my daughter's hair too. So, first and foremost, I do believe this is the miracle worker and i'm going to show you everything else i do believe this is the miracle worker for sure and just to let you know obviously i'm a small youtuber this is not sponsored at all this is what i really use on my hair and oh this this is like a shampoo um this is about i don't know like five six dollars i bought it at probably target or cvs any drugstore so secondly I use this called super grow and let me tell you this is almost done I already went through one of those shampoo those conditioners and that's my second one I just bought and look almost done my mom discovered this I don't know if someone told her about it or she just came across it and this is legit amazing amazing so she's been using this in our hair like all of our hair and like my mom's hair is super long when my brother had long hair um his hair was super long could be jeans given but i feel like when i've been using this lately and my hair i try to refrain from grease it's made with coconut oil but i try to refrain from it because you know i want to be all healthy and natural and one of the products I'm going to show you later, I try to use instead of this. And my hair was so frizzy. Anyway, I'm, I'm not saying this is right. Use grease, but this definitely defines my curls. So, yeah, this. And it helps your hair grow so fast. I recommend this to anyone. This is $4.99 and I got this from the beauty supply store. This is amazing. I feel like I'm saying everything's amazing, but legit, everything here makes, like, everything here works together to make my hair, you know, what it is. So, this one is $8. I got this from the regular beauty supply store. I believe I saw it in Target, at Target as well. It's a quenching coconut curls, frizz defying curl style and milk. And I feel like, again, this defines my curls. It hydrates. It looks so beautiful. Oh, my God. I love this so much. And I just, like, section my hair in fours and just put a big pump. And individually, each section, just play one pump for the back, one pump for the front. There you go. So, those are my three go-tos. Like, legit, when I wash my hair, I use that conditioner. I use that conditioner 100%, I use the grease, and I use the coconut curls. I can just live with those three. Now, 
I found out that I have heat damage. Well, I didn't find out. I did research and I realized like the middle of my crown, it's coarser than the rest of my hair. Like my hair is, I think it's like considered like 3B. Um, my, my crown area is like, like 3C, 4A-ish, if you guys hair type. Which, anyway, it's just thicker. And it's not as curly as the rest of my hair. It's just kind of like more frizzy all the time. Comes to find out it's heat damage from the sun. It can't be heat damage from like the um, flat iron or like any in, like any hair tools because I usually leave my hair curly for the most part. Um, I occasionally straighten it, but from my research, being that it's at the crown and the top, it's from the sun. So I'm in the process now of repairing that. But in the meantime, if I ever want to weigh my hair down and I don't have time for a twist out, I just pack on this godsend of a gel. And I know gel, they say, is not good for you, but Equal Style Gel, from my experience, it didn't harm my hair at all. It doesn't make it hard or crunchy, and it defines the middle of my hair. So, this is the one I use. I also use the, the, um, the olive oil one, but I think this one works better. I don't know it's just my opinion so now this is my backup now if I know I'm gonna weigh my hair up or if I'm gonna push it back I don't use this at all but if I want my hair out that's what I use thirdly fifthly this is an edge control which this was my first time using this exact one which ugh, smells so good I usually use the cream of nature one I'll into the picture right here but this one um the girl recommended because i i needed a stronger hold for my daughter's hair because um her hair is thicker than mine and especially in the for her it's just like the little baby hairs i try to get down to look like fresh so i end up using eco style gel for her but for me <clears throat> i use this and um i don't know i, I kind of find it the same as the cream of nature one honestly but anyway edge control i guess that's the essence this one works fine or the cream of nature one works great now oh wait but this is like a every time i do my hair type business you know what i mean i can't live without like all these products i can't live without and this is edge control is one of them it doesn't have to be this one and again i i made this comment in my last like hair video i put on my channel but it's essential to don't just buy this because I say this works for my hair. Um, some people have coarse, coarser or thicker hair than me, or a different texture, or just different whatever. You may this may not work for you, and you might need a stronger hold. So keep that in mind. And lastly, the bonus one. So what I just showed you is pretty much what I use um for wash and goes for twist out. For twist outs too, I don't use this one for a twist out. This one I just put in my hair for um, wash and goes. But instead of that, I'll put this bad boy. And this is the same name. Um, it's funny. This is the same brand. It's core, called... Old, I don't even know. OGX. And I'm going to list everything below with the link to Amazon. But this is just basically um, renewing argan oil of Morocco. Extra penetrating oil for dry and coarse hair. So this is what I use only for twist out. Um, I'm not going to even... If I put this with my wash and go, like my hair will legit be so frizzy. Um, and I don't like that. It used to work perfect. Now I'll have a big frizz ball. So I put this in my hair before my twist out and after my twist out so and it smells so good oh my god i know right so good so yeah that's it so i have no idea why i didn't properly close out this video while i was recording but I do want to thank you guys for watching and clicking on this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up or subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos here on YouTube. Thanks guys. Bye. This is like so by accident. 
and it looks so cute well I think so like I just did a pineapple like I was like <laughs> let me tell you how this came about I was laying my edges and then I was doing a pineapple to stretch my hair and it came out pretty cute might I say myself but anyway I'm so in love with 